Good morning. You know, feminism, they say they want to fight for women, right? And I want to protect women. We should be on the same side, but we are not. See, I have this dilemma. I have an impulse to protect women. And I don't have to think about it. It's not a decision that I made. It's just there. It's, it's instinct, you see. And then we have the feminists. They say that I'm sick, wanting to protect women. I shouldn't think like this. This is sick thinking. Yeah. So I'm thinking maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I shouldn't care about the women, but I do. Yeah. I know I will do it if there is a situation. I will protect them. You know, it's instinct. Yeah. But the feminists, they say, we want to fight for women. Yeah. But what I see is that, you know, here in Sweden, it's quite unsafe for women. Sweden is considered one of the most feminist countries in the world. Maybe the most feminist country in the world, yeah. But it's also very unsafe for women compared to other countries. Yeah, there was a study done, another one, uh, and they looked at uh, 78 different countries, a new study, and it was mainly based on crime statistics as well as the laws that exist to protect women's safety. And Sweden came in second. Right. It's South Africa, the most unsafe country in the world for women. And then it's Sweden. Uh, here's the f top five. South Africa, Sweden, El Salvador, Jamaica, Honduras. Right. So they say they want to protect women and then you have this. So I, I don't buy it, no. I don't think they care about women's safety. Now the thing is what they are doing is they are fighting the men and they are telling the men that they shouldn't be, care, they shouldn't care about the women, right? And then you get a society like Sweden. Yeah, so I think they are fighting the women, I mean the feminists. They're actually fighting the women. Feminism, their main target seems to be the women and the children. Yeah, because, yeah, well, you, then you have the abortions, right? Feminists, they are fighting for abortions. And there's another one. You see, I feel that I want to protect children too. Yeah, so I don't like abortions. I actually hate them. Yeah. And where you have a lot of feminism, you have a lot of abortions. Yeah. I saw this, this is from the WHO. They released updated guidelines claiming that laws that in any way prevent abortion during pregnancy risk violating the rights of women and that these restrictions should therefore be removed. So the WHO, you know, fighting for feminism, they are also killing infants. Yeah. So we are not on the same side. We are on the op we are on opposite sides. Me and the feminists. Right. Uh, by the way, the two safest countries in the world for women are Japan and Poland. Yeah. I've never been to Japan, but I've been to Poland. And it seems to me they have very traditional views on men and women. Very traditional. Yeah. So uh, feminism isn't very, very strong in Poland. But it's considered number two. Yeah. The second safest country in the world for women. Hmm. What do you think about this? All right, be good.